Hello Huskies, hello Bulldogs. Today I want to do a little science lesson with you with something called electricity. Now before we do this science experiment with electricity, uh, we need to talk about electricity because electricity can be very very dangerous. Okay, Electricity and things that go through wires like this are not toys because if you play with wires and you play with the wrong wire, you might get electrocuted and then you'll get hurt really bad and you have to go to the hospital. Okay, So I made a special toy here that I know is safe. So before you ever touch any wires or anything, you should definitely ask a grown-up if it's safe. Okay, The reason this one is safe is because it has a very small battery and it doesn't have very much electricity. But when you plug something into the wall, it has a lot of electricity. Okay. Now here's what we're going to do. What we're going to do is we're going to try to make this light bulb turn on using some electricity from the battery. Now the electricity is going from the battery and it's going this way into this wire. Then it's going to the light bulb and it's going this way into this wire. Now if we want the light bulb to turn on, what we need to do is we need to make the electricity go all the way around. So I'm going to put these together and I hope it turns on. Let's see. Ready? It worked. So right now we're making the electricity go, and I can even clip these on, we're making the electricity go right through there. Okay? The electricity is going all the way through the wires, right through here and all the way to the light bulb. Alright? Now here's what we're going to figure out. We're going to figure out if the electricity can go through some other things. Alright? Now I want you to think for a second. Do you think electricity goes through everything? Or do you think it only goes through some things? What do you think the electricity is going to go through? If you'd like, you can pause the video and you can make a prediction. You can make a hypothesis with your family. All right, I have one thing that I'd like to test. Can you see it? It's a Lego. Do you think the electricity is going to go through the Lego? Let's find out. I'm put this side onto here. If the electricity goes through, then the light bulb will turn on. Let's see, I'm going to clip it on here. The electricity is not going through the Lego. The light bulb is not turned on. So I'm going to make a pile. Let me move this over a little bit. Right here is going to be my pile of things right here that electricity does not go through. Okay. Let's try something else. Oh, I have a little tool. It's a wrench. See that little wrench? What's your hypothesis? Do you think the electricity will go through the wrench? Let's find out. Clip it onto that side. Clip it onto this side. <gasps> Look, the light bulb turned on. The electricity is going through the wrench and into the light bulb to make the light bulb turn on. So the wrench works. So I'm going to make another pile over here. Here's things that did work. Okay, and I'm going to put the wrench right here in this pile. Let me see, what else do I have to try? Ooh, I have a square. I have a yellow square. What do you think? Do you think the electricity will go through the square? Let's find out. Clip it onto that side. Clip it onto that side. Is it working? The electricity does not go through the square. The light bulb is not turning on right now. Let's try another one. Oh, so I have to put that in this pile here. Things that the electricity does not go through. Oh look, I have a screw and it has a little big it has a big washer right there and a little nut. These are some fasteners construction workers use and builders use. So let's try this. What do you think? Do you think the electricity will go through this? I'm going to clip it onto this side. Clip it onto this side. It works! The electricity is going through this big washer right here. So I'm going to put that in the pile of things that electricity goes through over here. What else do we have? Hmm, 
I have this big wire. It's flexible. You can move it a little bit. It's like a thick wire. What's your hypothesis? What's your prediction? Do you think this one will work? Do you think the electricity will go through here? Let's find out. Clip it onto this side. Clip it onto this side. Did it work? It turned on. That goes, the electricity is going through that one. All right, so we'll put that in this pile over here with the things that work. Let's see what else do we have. Ooh, I have a rubber band. What do you think about the rubber band? Do you think the electricity will go through the rubber band? Let's see. Clip onto this side. Now clip onto the other side with this one. Is the electricity going through? You can stretch it a little bit, but the light bulb is not turning on. The electricity is stopping right here and right here. It's not going through the rubber band. So I've got to put that in the other pile right here, the things that don't work. All right, what else do I have? I have a straw. It's a red straw. You see it? What do you think? Do you think this conducts electricity? That's a science word. When electricity goes through it, we say it conducts electricity. What do you think? Let's try it. Did it work? The light bulb did not turn on. The electricity is stopping right here. It's not going through. That does not conduct electricity. I'll put that in this pile over here with the things that don't work. Hmm, what else do we have? Oh, I have a coin. Look, it's a nickel. It's a little coin. It's called a nickel. What do you think? Do you think the electricity will go through? Let's see. Clip onto this side. I'm going to clip onto the other side. Hey, it works. The electricity goes through here. This conducts electricity. All right. Put that in the pile with things that do conduct electricity. What else do I have? I have a string. It's really long. It's a really long string. What do you think? You think the electricity will go through? Let's try it. Clip onto this side of the string right here. Then I'm going to clip onto this side over here. Did it work? Nope, the electricity is not going through the string, right? If I, if I touch these right to each other, then the electricity doesn't have to go through the string. It can just go right from here to here. But when I pull it apart, it's not going through the string, right? So I got to put that in this pile over here with stuff that is not conducting electricity. Oh, this is a paper clip. Paper clip is used for holding things together, but I unwrapped it and now it's just a big long piece of uh, piece of paper clip like that. What do you think? Think it'll work? Think the electricity will go through? Let's see. Clip onto that side. Clip onto this. Hey, it works. The electricity is going right through the paper clip. Right from this side all the way through and it's making the light bulb turn on. So I gotta put that in the pile over here with stuff that works. All right, what else do I have? I have a penny, it's another coin. The penny, the penny is a different color, right? Let's clip onto this side of the penny. You think this one's gonna work? It works. The electricity is going through the penny. Let's keep going, I got more stuff to try. Do you notice anything about all the stuff that works and all the stuff that doesn't work? Do you have any hypotheses? Do you have any ideas about why this stuff works, but these things don't work? Keep thinking. Maybe by the end we'll figure it out. Let's try a crayon. This crayon is big, it's hard to clip onto. What do you think? You think the electricity is gonna go through? No, it's not. The crayon is not working. Crayons are made out of wax. And there's some paper on the crayon too. The electricity is not going through that, right? Oh, it's a chopstick. Chopsticks are made out of wood. It's a wooden chopstick. 
you think the electricity is going to go through it? Let's find out. Let's see if it conducts electricity. It's not turning on. The electricity is stopping right there, and it's stopping right there. It's not going through the wood, so the light bulb is not turning on. Let's see, what else do I have? I have some tin foil. Sometimes I use this in my kitchen to cover up food, but right now it's all wrapped up. It's also called aluminum foil. Sometimes it's made with aluminum, sometimes it's made with tin. What do you think? You think the electricity will go through? Let's find out. Let's see if it conducts electricity. It does. Yeah, it's turning off and on a little bit, but the electricity is going through it. I'm going to pinch it, make sure it holds on tight. The electricity is going right through the tin foil. So that one works. I got to put that in this pile over here. It's the stuff that conducts electricity. What else do I have? Oh, I have a big popsicle stick. All right, one of my friends colored on this one. All right. Do you think the electricity will go through the popsicle stick? Let's try it. Clip onto this side. Clip onto this side. Oh, it's not working. The electricity is not going through the popsicle stick. So I gotta put that in this pile with the stuff that does not conduct electricity. Oh look, it's a little rubber toy. Rubber and plastic. Let's see. It's gonna be hard to clip on, it's really thick. Okay, I got it on that side. Do you think it's going to go through? It's not. It's not conducting electricity. Okay, we got a few more things. I got to put that in this pile over here with the stuff that doesn't work. I have, oh look, it's a little clip thing. It's a metal clip. See that metal clip? Let's try it. Let's clip onto here. Clip onto here. It works. Look, the electricity is going through here or through here or both. The electricity is going all the way through and it's making the light bulb turn on. Right. So I gotta put that in this pile over here. Oh, uh oh, this is gonna be interesting. I have two knives, but they're different knives, right? Can you tell what's different about these knives? They're both knives, that's the same. But what's different about them? Let's try this one first. Let's try this knife. Let's see if electricity will go through this knife. The electricity is not going through that knife. That knife does not conduct electricity. All right? I'll put that in this pile. Now let's try this knife. To hold it up so it doesn't fall. This knife does conduct electricity. Is turning on. The electricity is going through this knife, right? So I'll put that in this pile. Look, I have two spoons also. They're both spoons, that's the same, but how are they different? Can you think of ways that they're different? Let's try this spoon first. Clip onto this side. You think it's gonna work? It does. The electricity goes through this spoon. I think it works. Let's clip onto this spoon right here. See, do you think this one's gonna work? Let's see. That one doesn't work. Oh boy. Let's look at all this stuff that we have looked at. Here's all the stuff that the electricity went through. All of these things conducted the electricity. All of these things did not conduct the electricity. Let's look at these long and hard and think. What do you think conducts electricity? None of this stuff conducts electricity. All of this stuff does conduct electricity. How are all of these things the same? What do you think something has to be or have if it's going to conduct electricity? I have some ideas, but I don't want to tell you my ideas. I want the Huskies and Bulldogs to come up with their own ideas about what conducts electricity.
you can share that with your family, all right? Now remember, when you're at your home and when you're at school, when you're at other places, it's not a good idea to play with electricity, right? I want you to keep in mind that electricity is not a toy. But sometimes if there's a grown-up there, you can ask them and you can say, can I touch that wire? They're probably going to say, no, that's not safe. But you might someday be able to play with some toys that are made for children to play with. Okay. Thanks for playing games with me. I hope you guys had fun. Maybe you learned something about electricity today. Right? Bye, Huskies. Bye, Bulldogs.